Hi friends. So today's video is all about how to make your lips look a little bit fuller using Mascara Beauty Highlight, Contour, and our Lip and Cheeks. I'm doing all of my makeup out of this compact today. This compact is called the Hack Stack Compact. It's just like our quad compact that holds four singles, except it's a double layer compact, so it holds eight singles, or it holds 16 eyeshadows. The shades I'm going to be working with today are Henna, Bella Bronzer, Indigo, Moonlit, Frenchy Sadie, Dulce Illuminator, and Petal. I was recently watching another artist on Instagram and she did this whole tip for her lips. And for someone like me who has really tiny lips, it was really worth it. It's a few different steps. So this isn't probably something that you would want to do on the daily. If you had an event you were going to, date night, out with the girls, whatever it would be, these are tips and tricks to help you achieve fuller lips. I'm taking my multitasker brush. This is my old brush. I cannot find my new multitasker brush. So this one has the wood in the middle. We do not sell this kind any longer, but I'm going to take the small end, the pencil end of it and tap into this shade right here that's called Henna. And I'm just gonna line my lips just like you would with any kind of lip liner pencil. So just go around the whole perimeter of the lip. You can already see that that gave my lips quite a bit of definition. I do like to do a little bit more shadowing right here under my lip. I feel like it gives a really nice pout. So I'm gonna go back just with a little bit more. Now I'm using the blend and tap brush, the dome side, and I'm tapping into our Bella bronzer and I'm going to use it as an all over lip shade. I feel like the Bella Bronzer along with that henna contour for the lining really gives my lips a nice full appearance. Now at this point, if you'd like to, you can go back into this darker shade called Indigo and you can give a little bit more definition to the lining of the lip. I'm focusing on this bottom part and right here at my Cupid's bow. I was kind of toying between Frenchie and Petal. Because of my sweater shade today, I've decided to go with Petal. Um, but either one of these are gonna pair really nicely with this look today. Now I'm tapping into this really, really light shade of highlight called Moonlit, and I'm going to apply it just right in the center of my lips. Anytime that we bring light to the center of our lips, it creates the illusion of a little bit fuller of a lip. Take my finger and I'm going to blend that out. Now I'm going into this shade, which is called Sadie, and I'm going to put it all over the lip, but not quite as much in the center where I just applied that Moonlit. Sadie is a satin finish formula, so it's going to give a little sheen to my lips. Oh, that feels so creamy. I love Sadie. It's kind of the unsung lip and cheek of our collection. I'm taking that blend and tap brush. I'm gonna use the flatter end and I'm tapping into Dulce Illuminator now. And again, I'm gonna keep it right in the center. Oh, 
I'm gonna clean off that same end that I just used just a little bit and I'm going to blend out this line so it's not such a striking line. I'm gonna go back with my multitasker, the small end, into indigo, and I'm going to sharpen up my Cupid's bow just a little. So in just a few little steps, we were able to create the illusion of fuller looking lips, which on me, it makes a really big difference. I love the Hackstack Compact because we can just throw it all in one. One compact, throw it in your bag, and if you need to touch up throughout the night for whatever you're wearing this lip look for, then you are all set. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. I would love for you to subscribe and share this video and I will be putting all of the shades and the products that I used in the description of this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.